Hello everyone, my name is Peep Peep, and welcome to talking about the Final Fantasy Freddy's Security Breach trailer. So, let's just get right into it. Okay, first off we have is Vanny, and I was looking at this live, and it's just so... Everything was happening all at once. But obviously we have Vanny popping up. And then she says you're trapped. And then we have Lamar Chica. I'm not really sure what she's doing here. It looks like she's doing something. Whether she might be repairing herself, I'm not sure. No, it looks like she's eating something. You see that? Let's go back. Yeah, she looks like she's eating something of some sort. And then she attacks us. And then she's all like messed up. I think we're Vanessa. See, she's all destroyed. Um, she looks pretty gross right now. The Mega Pizza Plex is what it's called. Um, it looks really nice looking at everything. And then we have the them all shown up. And it's really huge. This must be a really big place. And that might be, you know, this guard, Vanessa's voice. And then she goes again. And so this is, we have the Sun animatronic. See? So it looks really cool. We can go around and do different things. There's Vanessa walking around, hopping around, doing her little thing. And then we have the moon animatronic. And then again, we have, like, I'm assuming the bathrooms. And I don't really know what this would be. I feel like the locker rooms? I didn't know they had those in malls. And then it looks like we can get inside <laughs> this funny image. But we can get inside Glamrock, which is really cool. I'm assuming we're Vanessa. And he's allowing us to get inside of him, unless we're Gregory, which I don't think so. So I'm assuming he's having us a hiding place, or maybe he'll help us walk around, I'm not sure. Oh no, we can control him! I didn't really notice this before. Uh-oh, Glamrock Chico's running after us. That seems really scary. I like how we can roam around more. Okay, so I'm assuming who is talking is Freddy, the Glamrock Freddy. At 6 a.m. Until then, keep moving and try not to draw attention to yourself. If there is another way out. And it looks like we have a sprinting mechanic, so we can only sprint for so long. I will help you find. And we have this thing. I don't know what this is, but it kind of looks like earlier FNAF stuff, like from FNAF 6. I think it is. And then we have more of this locker room. We have Glamrock Chica just kind of standing there. I love her design so much. Really cute. So I'm assuming we stunned her or something. Or it didn't look like it, but unless we're inside of Glamrock Freddy, it looked like she just got stunned or something. I'm not really sure. Unless we can stun her somehow. Look at their designs. Really cool. I love this, like, aesthetic we have going on here. We got Roxanne Wolf. A really, really cool character. I honestly really like her a lot. And then her running off. And it looks like after a while she gets tired too. So I'm assuming that's kind of what happened to Glamrock Chica. She got tired and she just took a little break. And got Glamrock Chica, probably one of my favorites. I really love her guitar. I like that she actually has an instrument because in the early game she never did. So that's really cool. It looks like we're in some weird mine shaft, and she's really gross. That's probably how she got dirty earlier from the mine shaft. And that's probably what she's picking at in here. But yeah, it looks really cool. I wonder where this is. Probably really close in here, so that's pretty cool. Oh, and her little run. That was pretty cool. I like that. Okay, that was really cool. A Montgomery Gator. He's really cool. like his design. Probably my least favorite, but I still like them all. 
Okay, he definitely can smash things. I'm assuming what we can do, we can use him to smash other things. Like, if there's an area we need him to break, we can take him there and he'll smash it or something. That's what I'm thinking. And then we have the star of the show, Glamrock um, Freddy or Freddy Fazbear, which I'm, I think it's funny they didn't put Ram Glamrock in his name. Look at his victory pose. Super cool. Uh-oh, the twitching. A really funny pose I've stopped at, but... I love his earring. Please make your... Oh wait, so does he... Did, did he activate it or something? Is that why he fell over? And then there's Vanny, of course. They're talking about glasses. A voucher for one free soda refill. And where you will sign a legal disclaimer, releasing us of all liability for anything that might have happened during your visit. Uh-oh, so again, there's more liability stuff. Have an awesome night, and we'll see you again soon. And then there's Vanny. We got Halo Infinite in the way, but oh well. And then here are these guys. These look really gross. They kind of look like the puppet. I don't know. There's maybe some crying children. Who knows? Would you like to take a short survey about your experience? No. So people keep theorizing, theorizing about the numbers. I don't know what they mean to be honest with you. But okay, so I wanted to relook at some stuff from the other FNAF trailer we got back in February. Obviously, I wanted to look back because I don't think I made a video talking about the FNAF trailer before, but obviously that has to be William, like, who else would it be? Um, I am sad that he didn't, they didn't make him British this time, probably just a different voice actor, I assume, but it's really interesting because I think that Vanny is being controlled, so I feel like in the game, at the end, people keep saying Vanny and Vanessa are the same person, you know, like the Night Guard, I don't think so. Unless the Night Guard actually has a different name, but I kind of doubt it at now. But I don't really like that the game names are too similar. But overall, Vanny, I love her hop. I think it's amazing. I just love it. Look at that cute little hop. Then again, you get a nice look at the Night Guard. I just really like this trailer too to get a nice look. The newer trailer is mostly just showing off everything that has to do with like more gameplay wise and everything else. But it just makes, I just feel like they're, and since this is a different timeline from the main FNAF, like did the bite of 87 actually happen you know if it did did it happen in 87 or did it happen some other time or i don't really think there was a bite to be honest with you but there obviously are dead children that happened um i don't know how many i'm assuming gregory either might be the first or he's not the first The best animatronic in my opinion. I love all the chicas and Glamrock Chica is definitely my top five of chicas or top three maybe. Number one would have to be like Chica, number two Toy Chica, and three Glamrock Chica now. Okay, look how beautiful they are. Amazing. Gregory, we can get you out of here. You and me together. So, the thing is, I feel like Vanny might be able to duplicate or sort of replicate Vanessa's voice. So, I think Gregory might think, know this or something, and might be trying to hide. Or maybe Vanessa's a part of this, but I kind of doubt it. I just feel like she's trying to help out. We don't really know. Who knows? But I still think we're gonna, like, change between being Gregory or Vanessa, but also I feel like that, I don't know. Now that I'm thinking about it, that probably won't happen. We'll probably just stay Vanessa, but we're secretly the bad guy. Maybe. Not too sure, actually. Okay, get a nice, really good look of the place. Um, of course, this is Montgomery's area. 
Monty's. Very nice. I really like it. I feel like if you went here, it'd actually have, like, sort of a rainforest sort of smell. You know, like, if you go to a zoo, you probably would understand the smell. Okay, so this makes you think that we're not actually Vanessa, but doubt it. Cause, like, you don't know. Maybe we are going to be Gregory sometimes hiding from Vanessa. I don't know. I'm not really sure. They won't stop hunting you. None of them will stop hunting you. Okay, so this area looks like in the newer trailer where the mines and everything, so I'm assuming this is where these lead up. Just looking back on it now, it definitely looks like it. This one's my favorite area. I really love these areas. You got Glamrock Chica's area. Very cute. I love it. So I'm assuming when they're, it's online, you know, and it, no, I mean, you know, like they're actually live and you can go to the mall and everything. I'm assuming what is happening, you can actually see them in the room separately at time. Yeah. See, she's doing her little thing. This is so cute. I wonder if you can go in there. It looks like you can. It looks like you can like rent out these areas. I'm assuming that obviously you don't, we don't get to see it during the daytime, but you can probably rent out these areas during the daytime and just have your own private show with each animatronic. And her floor is so cute. That's adorable. I love it. <laughs> the ball pit. I, I know it's just a ball pit, but it makes you think, you know, into the pit. It's too funny. So I think that is, um, I just forgot his name. You know, the alligator guy, I think that's him. That is definitely not Freddy's voice. Oh wait, so we did see the watch before, and I think that watch is Gregory's watch, maybe? Unless Vanessa does have the watch, but I'm not actually too sure. Oh geez, looks like even, even not Toy Chica. Glamrock Chica can knock stuff over too. And that's where we lead off into the other one. Okay, final thoughts. Final thoughts overall, definitely re-watching this trailer had made me, like, remember a lot more things, just because, you know, it's been since everywhere, it's been a while. Um, but overall, I don't know if we're gonna be Gregory or Vanessa. Probably we're gonna be Vanessa. But honestly, I kind of doubt it, because, <laughs> like, I feel like I'm on the fence, I don't really know. Because there are lines where Vanessa's talking to Gregory, and it feels like we're actually Gregory. But we're able to hide in. The thing is why I feel like I'm leaning more towards where Gregory is because if you saw that one statue, st statue, we are going inside of Glamrock Freddy. And we do that in that trailer, in the newer one. And so we're definitely Gregory. I feel like it's more that we're going to be Gregory, but who knows. Overall, I am really excited for this game to watch people uh, make theories, talk about the trailer overanalyzing it just super excited to see when the game comes out do i think it's going to come out this year i don't know it is october so we might get it in december but i kind of doubt it but hey you don't really know but i really hope you enjoyed this because i did um it's really nice seeing the trailer and i did watch it live it was amazing so yeah thank you all for watching leave a like and subscribe and i will of course see you on the next one goodbye everyone